Okay, so we should just have to reload this then, I guess. Um... Which is easily done. Oh, let's get properly comfortable. Eh. Oh, I don't like it when it just loads into like silence. Right, okay, so apparently we have to go back to um I think it's like Alpha's lab or something. So there you go. That's what we're doing. Oh why is it so quiet? Ah, oh, I hate it. Where's the happy fun music? And of course, if anybody's got like suggestions on things that I need, that I should do or need to do, then obviously, you know, let me know and I will go back and I will do it to the best of my abilities, that is. the right way oh oh god I gotta remember her name um hey uh this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. Human, you have to deliver something for me. Uh, please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyrus's. See ya, punk! Okay. Seems like we're on the right lines. <laughs> Making our way back to the beginning of the game. Yes, that's what we're doing. Wait, no, not this way. This way? Yes. <gasps> My God. I'll always remember that you remember. Okay, little fireman. Please select a location. Um. Left or one? Maybe? Perhaps? Bum ba da bum bum ba ba da ba dum bum bum ba ba dum bum ba ba Tra la la, careful ride, ride in the boat. Where will we go today? Snowden. Erp, erp, erp. Weird little dog boat. Oh. Uh oh. Suddenly feeling tropical. I hate it. I hate it when that happens. You know, you just. One minute you're nice and you're chill, and then just suddenly a tropical feeling washes over you. Come 
I need to find some more tags for this. I don't seem to have that many. Uh, yeah, there you go. No, no spoilers. Um, oh, I'm getting all the not notifications on the Twitters. Uh, okay. Okay, we'll leave it at that for the time being. Right, okay, with my cold, dead eyes. Actually, I'm going to go back one. Back. That's better. I feel more comfortable now. Right. Hey. Hey, I have something to give you. Or you're carrying way too much. Oh, for Pete's sake. Uh, wait, this one. Going this way is quicker. Ah! Get off me, Papyrus. No! Undyne. Ah! Let's put away those two. Give us a bit of extra space. Um, so I have a favor to ask you. Uh, I, I need you to deliver this letter to Dr. Alphys. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Uh, well... It's kind of personal, but we're friends, so... I'll tell you. Holland sucks. I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to have to go over there. So here you go. Oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. Any thoughts? And Dan writes a lot of letters, but she can never seem to find the right words. So when she goes to deliver them herself, she always quits so she can go back and rewrite it. That's why she asked you. Because you have no standards. Wow. Asshole. Ugh. <sighs> Fine. To the hot lands. Yes. I'd love a ride. I'd like to take a ride in your Winnie. I mean, it makes no sense, random deaf boatman. Okay. It doesn't appear to be too much with the um, with the true pacifist run. So at least it won't take us too long by the looks of it. Hopefully we'll be able to get it done this, maybe this stream? I'm gonna guess this is Alphys saying this. Uh, oh no, is that another letter? I don't wanna open it. C can I just slide it back out? Oh my god, I just need to get the right inflection of the voice. No, no, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Fuck was that? Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god. Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have. Oh my god. Oh no. That's adorable. And I had, I had no idea you were 
wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven, much less, um, this, and so passionately, too. You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, let's go on a date. Wait, what? Uh, sorry. I'm still getting dressed. Oh, wow. How do I look? My friend helped me pick this out. Oh, this dress. She's got a great sense of... Um, anyway, let's do this thing. Hey, hey, wait. Actually, we still can't start the date yet. Fucking hell. Um, I've gotta give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chance of a successful outcome to the date. Right? Anyway, don't worry, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. First, I've got some metal armor polish. Um, maybe you can't use that. But, I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales. Your uh, scales. Uh, well, uh, I see what's going on there. Oh, uh, well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I. Um, hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. Yeah, let's uh, date. Uh, do you like anime? I mean, yeah, who doesn't? Hey, me too. Fuck no. Hey, let's go somewhere. But where's a good place to go on a date? I've got it. Let's go to the garbage dump. What? Why? But why? Why the guard? Why the garbage dump? Here we are. This is where Undyne and I. Uh, this is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. <laughs> She's really. Uh. Oh no. That's her over there. I I can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because, uh, well, oh no, here she comes. Hey, there you are. I, uh, realized if you deliver that thing, it might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it? Ah! Have you at least seen her? I feel like we should be honest. Yes? So she's somewhere around here. Thanks. I'll keep looking. Oh my god. Well, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, uh, I really like her. Ah. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just figured, you know. It'd be fun to go on, like, a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. I'm a child, for God's sake. What's wrong with you? Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. I'm sorry. I messed up again. Undyne's the person I um, really want to go on a date with. But, I mean, she's way out of my league. Not that you aren't, um, cool, but Undyne, 
She's so confident and strong and funny. And I'm just a nobody. A fraud. I'm the royal scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies. She thinks I'm she thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. If she gets close to me, she'll she'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? I mean, tell her the truth. Because then at some point she will find out and then you'll be fucked. The truth. But if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or a truth where neither of us are? They say be yourself. But I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. Wow, come on. No, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They're, they'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the truth? I don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? <laughs> let's roleplay it. Obviously, let's roleplay. Uh, that one sounds a little bit mean, so. Roleplay. That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be Undyne? I suppose it makes more sense for me to be Undyne. Oh, right, obviously. <laughs> Hi, Undyne. How are you today? How are you doing today? Ha mm. <laughs> ha, glad to hear it. Uh, so I'd like to um talk to you about something. Um, you see, I, I, I haven't exactly been truthful with you. You see, I, oh, forget it. I'm dying. I, I want to tell you how I feel. You're so brave and so strong and nice. Y you always listen to me when I talk about n nerdy stuff. You always do your best to make me feel special like telling me that you'll beat up anyone that gets in my way I'm dying I can't take this any longer I'm ready in love with you oh me I'm dying help me what did you just say uh I'm dying I was just Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. What's the occasion? Oh, shit. Wait a second. Are you two on a date? Uh, yeah. I mean, uh, no. I mean, we were, but, I mean, actually, we were only romantically role-playing as you. What? I mean, I mean, Undyne, I, I've been lying to you. What? What about? About what? Never mind. About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was like, Jesus Christ, and those, <laughs> fuck, Jesus, stop. And the history movies, those, those are just uh, anime. They aren't real. And that time I told you I was busy working with a phone, I was actually eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas. Alphys. I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. I wasn't some nerdy loser. Alphys. Undyne, I, I really can't, <laughs> I really think you're neat, okay? Alphys.
Alphys. I think you're neat too, I guess. But you've got to realize, most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all that stuff is nerdy crap. What I like about you is you're passionate. You're analytical. It doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. 100% at maximum power! So, you don't have to lie to me. I don't... <laughs> I don't want I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Alphys, I want you to become happy with who you are. And I know that I know just the training that you need to do that. Fucking Jesus. Undyne you 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 gonna train me? Pfft, what? Me? Oh my fucking god. Nah, I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones shaking! It's time to jog a hundred laps, hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. Undyne, I'll do my best. Fucking, what is this game? Oh my god. She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are still real, right? Anime's real, right? Ha ha ha! I knew it. Gigantic swords, magical princesses, here I come. Uh, thanks for taking care of Alphys. I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but things like the things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well, I gotta go catch up with them later. Ah, ain't that sweet? Here go, bitch. Ooh, anything in this one, or this pile, or this one. <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? I love a bit of astronaut food. So I gotta get into the the voice room. I, the great Papyrus, howdy! If it isn't my good friend who trusts me, this is Papyrus, your also mutual friend. Alphys and I finished our training early, very early. So I sent her home, very home. Uh, now, I feel strongly, and for no apparent reason, you should also go there. To her lab house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye. Man, uh, Papyrus, you need to get better at lying, you sack of shit. Well, that went well, so let's... Let's save. Wait, did we buy that? We didn't buy the key, because we decided that we didn't need it. Ugh. Mr. Neil Boatman. I'd love a ride. To the hot land. To the hot land. Please take me to the hottest of lands. Are ah, indeed. Sure, let's read it. 
Hey. Thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me. But as difficult as it is to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to stop doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You all at least deserve to know what I did. Wow. That's... Okay. Oh. And that was the end of the game. This is it. Oh, this is all in Alphys's voice, isn't it? Oh, it's hard work. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. So, to create more, we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And, unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I could make a monster's soul last. Wait, what? Number five? Missed one there. I've done it. Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human souls. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death. The will to keep living. The resolve to change fate. Let's call this power. Determination. So that's like what the save stuff is. Okay. Okay. Well, this is horrifying music. Chips. Elevator, last power, enter the center door. Okay, All right, well, let's go up here then. Okay, we won't do that. Let's go this way then. Asgore asked everyone outside the city for monsters that had fallen down. Their bodies came in today. They're still, com they're still comatose and soon they all turn into dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they perish then freedom might be closer than we all thought. Sounds like you're doing some shady shit. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get the souls. I told the families that I would give them the dust back out for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. 
What do I do? What's up, Sai? How you doing, man? Well, these look, things look gross. Ah! Oh, come join the... Ooh, okay. Come join the fun? No, I think I'll be okay. Thank you. Ah! Ow! Fucking stay up there, you bastards. But nobody came. I mean, this is just a little bit disconcerting, really. Ow. Can we maybe just chill out for a second, you fucking freaks? Seems like it doesn't care anymore. Ooh, a red key. Cool. Right, well, I guess we got to go deeper then. There's a note on the ground. Can't make it all out. Drain dropped it. Ah, uh, okay. Cool. Oh, God. Oh, God. What is this message? Afternoon, AJ. Uh, wait, mine boy, uh, some rune snow didn't help me, that's all. The other ground, true, okay. What's that for? Is that all for um, Ujima Flip, for True Pacifist? I mean, I think I've heard most of that stuff. Yeah, I've heard about the, the Frisk thing before. But is that all just like, um, just like how to get all of the different endings or something? So now we should be able to go up here then. Hey! Nothing is happening. I don't know what to do. I just keep injecting everything with determination. I want this to work. I mean, that doesn't sound like a great idea, but sure. One of the bodies opened its eyes. Ah! Kind of creepy the way that you just leave it like that. Ah, oh, little dog ball. Everyone that have fallen down has woken up. They're all walking around and talking like nothing is wrong. I thought they were goners. Sounds like whatever you did worked. Oh, 
Oh, right, okay. Okay. Well. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll see how far we get without kind of going through all of that. Okay, well, thanks for stopping by anyway, mine. Uh, we'll need a vessel to wield the monster's souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of other monsters. Just as a human cannot absorb a human soul. So then, what about something that's neither human nor monster? Oh, now you're getting into like weird shit. Classic scientist reaching, reaching further than you should. Experiments on the vessel are a failure. It doesn't seem to be any different from the control cases. Whatever. They're a hassle to work with anyway. The seeds just stick to you and won't let go. Oh, hello. Hello. Just awful, awful thing. What do you want? We're in, the, we're in the middle of a very atmospheric moment and you're just walking in front of the, the screen. Okay, well, let me try and operate around you. Get out of the way! Little shit! Come on. Okay, I'm just gonna have to look over here. Huh, uh, Mr. Fly, hum, pray, clean, clean? Weird that. The fuck? This is weird. I don't like this. Okay, maybe, uh, hum. Okay. Do I, uh, oh god. Oh god. Ah! Eee! Ow, shit. Okay, right, so it's not Mr. Uh, Mr. Fire. Ow, shit. Damn it. Right, so eat a glam burger. Yum, yum. What can I do for you, Bilbo? Ah, shit, fuck off. Come down here then. Okay, remain on in the center. Uh, so we've done mystify, we've done harm, we've done clean. Don't do this to me. Okay, well then, Prey is like the last one. Someone finally gets it. Ribbit, ribbit, courage. Oh god! There's so many butterflies. Butterflies of death. Woo. Yeah, come on. There you go. Come down, you little shitbag. Okay, just chill out there then. There's a note on the ground. Can't make it all out. Cold. Uh, what? Cold? What the fuck am I supposed to do with cold? I uh, know, right? Oh, oh, there you go. There you go. 